Ovi, this is the time. This is the moment of the show that I've been waiting on. Yeah. I want to talk about the Heisman hopefuls. Okay, we have three of that are already down. Yeah. But I want to know how the top four ends up. Please tell me because we have three and a half weeks left, and I want to tell I want you to show us how it ends up. Now I understand everyone wants to know who's gonna win the Heisman this year, but it's actually turned into a race, like a, a running back race, because you have so many running backs in the Heisman in, in the Heisman race. And I love it. Being a former running back and former fullback, I love the fact that they're finally giving these guys who took that rock some love. But the outside looking in, Baker Mayfield, Leonard Fournette, Corey Coleman. I feel bad for Leonard Fournette. He started out so strong, but because of I think his office line didn't help him out, he struggled a little bit. But for number four, we're going with another running back, Dalvin Cook. You hit that here, I'll put him there. Dalvin Cook, a guy who missed the game and still is at the top of the nation in running rushing yards and touchdowns and everything else. This guy's leading the ACC in almost every single running back category. He's a beast. But Florida State, they're out of it. They, they've lost too many games. They're not going to be winning, so that kind of hurts fair. you when it comes to the Heisman. That's fair. Number three, Ezekiel Elliott, Ohio oh, State. Ezekiel. Ezekiel Elliott, I love this guy. 181 yards last week versus Indiana. He's somebody who can run outside. He can run inside. He has speed. He has power. He has what you need. And what most importantly, he has zero, count it, zero games under 100 yards, nice. which means that he's consistent. Number two, Derrick Henry, Deshaun Watson, who am I uh, choosing? You say you're a running back uh, now. I'm a running back, but I'm choosing Derrick Henry. What? Yeah, I know. I know. This, I don't like it. I don't think it makes sense. He had a big game versus Leonard Fournette at LSU. Well, it wasn't versus Leonard Fournette, but it was kind of like those two, two, two guys battling. And when you have big games in prime time, good things happen. Derrick Henry had a big game at LSU, and they had over 200 yards versus Mississippi State. Over 200 yards. This guy is toting the rock Huge. against great teams. But number one has to be Deshaun Watson because I hate to say it, but it's a quarterback's award. It's always been a quarterback's award. You get the best running back and the best quarterback they're going to give it to the quarterback every single time. And Deshaun Watson, playing for Clemson, hit that one more time. Hard. There we go. Bam. Deshaun Watson playing for Clemson, the number one team in the nation that, that carries a lot of weight. That means a lot to Heisman winners. I never liked the fact that you got to be a great player and on a great team doing the Heisman. That's the way it's been going. That's the way it's going to keep on going. Deshaun Watson putting up great numbers, leading his team to victory. This is my Heisman list. I like your Heisman list because this is an ACC show. Yeah. And we finish off with the ACC Bam. quarterback at the top. Guys, don't go anywhere. We have more ACC Grand Island Live coming up soon.